Hey, this is Omar with the University Daily Kansan Arts and Culture section. Today we'll be talking to Elsa Pigler, a university alum, also known on social media and YouTube as Elsa Ray. Let's go to it. Tell me about your House of Cards fascination and what you thought of the last season. I think the first and second seasons were my favorite, but I'm so invested in the show that it's, I'm never going to disapprove of any of the seasons. Have you done, I, I know you do, uh, you've done the House of Cards one, and I saw you do another Archer one. Is this something that you, you do specifically, you kind of try to add a little bit of pop culture in your videos? Lately, I haven't been doing too much pop culture stuff, just because everybody does it. I, my thing, my look that first got me ever noticed was my Game of Thrones White Walker stuff. That was viral two years ago. That was cool. It's kind of cool. Um, Pop culture stuff connects not only the females with the makeup, but the guys with right. the music or TV. Or was there something specific that you kind of saw that, like, oh, there's people that are now watching my video regularly? What kind of brought that to your mind? Um, I started my channel in November 2013. It was pretty steady at, like, 400 subscribers. And then six months later, my White Walker went viral. Uh -huh. And that brought a lot of people who were interested in makeup, um, interested in the gaming culture. Yeah. Um, and I mean, I'm interested in gaming culture, so that was kind of cool. I guess it was that White Walker that was like, oh, people take this. Yeah, right. I should do more yeah. these things. Um, then a year later, I made it into a cosmetic competition. So my channel used to get. So, kind of tell me. Um, Pick out, it doesn't have to be um, something recent, but kind of give me your daily routine, what that looks like when you're going to have a shoot. Kind of give me a step-by-step -step of that. And then what is your social media plan too? Because I know you probably have a specific thing you got to do with that. Um, if I'm doing something on myself, I generally block out the entire morning uh, for setting up all my lights, setting up all my paint. It's anywhere from two to six hours to do a look okay. on myself. Yeah. Um, and then the editing process, I took a pain in the ass. <laughs> uh, that takes maybe six to ten hours. Yeah, wow, right. Is there anything, is there ever been something that has come up while you're doing one of those, um, one of those uh, videos that y you said that like, you kind of wanted to stay like, Focus, but you had to go do something else. Like I feel like that'd be something. Oh, that, right, exactly. That would come up. I was doing a Cortana body paint, and I was all blue. Okay. And, um, and I had to go pick up my mother from the eye doctor. <laughs> eye injections. Really. And you can see the Snapchat in that video. It's really funny. I just okay. covered myself with a blue scarf. Yeah. With a blue face and blue sunglasses. I don't know why I put the blue face right there. Right. Me, so. Yeah. Sure. That was terribly embarrassing. I ran into a man who oh. stopped in the parking lot staring at me. Really? It's like, why are you staring right. at I mean, me? I, but then it was I like, I'm blue, blue, right? Exactly. Again, thank you again for taking your time out and speaking yeah. with me. Um, I hope I get to talk to you again in the future with uh, other stuff that you'll be doing.